things work very well. Um, I mean, you have to ask uh, Igor. <laughs> but my opinion is that um, we are we have conversation daily, and and when we have uh, have our spell where it was a little bit less, uh, where we didn't do so well, that is where my experience, where I can help him uh, with all that I have uh, made before, because I know how it is in football. It goes up and down. That is the most important thing, what I also try to give to Igor. So listen, let us make mistakes, but never make the same mistakes twice. Uh, and uh, I think he's, uh, he's a good listener as well. Uh, and uh, I can only say I'm very pleased to work, uh, work together with, uh, with Igor. I have one thing which is very, very important. That is that there's only one who decides about who's playing the 11 and is the coach and who's on the bench is the coach nobody else she'll never interfere it's not my job to pick the team and it's for me very important that he feel comfortable and he has to have the backing for me that i i think and i stand behind that and also i think that he will do the right uh, decisions I think, first of all, the Babatov came very late on the, uh, the, the 2nd of September. He didn't have any pre-season. Uh, he's not the youngest anymore, uh, so we were very careful with him in the beginning. Obviously, what are you expecting from, from a player like Babatov? That he scores every game, that he's giving assist every game. I don't think you can do that also not to him. First of all, just enjoy it because he can give so much to the club with his experience, with his uh, class and he's you see it when he came on here in how, how quick he can play he's not the quickest but he's very quick thinking it's it's in the playoffs uh, maybe hopefully in the big games in the in for the cup as well that we need a player like uh, Berbatov. good the good thing is that we um, we agreed, all of us, Mr. Savidis, but also the coach and I, we agreed we don't need to have players in for the squad. Uh, only we were looking for a right fullback because what happened with Konstantinidis uh, and also the problem with uh, Kitsu, he has been injured, so we need a backup there. But that is something what you always have to be alert with something happened. But mainly we said, if we want to do a transfer, then we do it one who can go in and make us stronger, if that is possible. There's not a lot of... Uh, uh, players quality but I say which, which we need have been in the market uh, but it's still it's still, every day comes new uh, new new uh, candidates unfortunately we had a one or two which we want but they uh, uh, chose to go somewhere else which can happen uh, but I'm not uh, I'm not uh, negative about that we can uh, still can uh, can come to agreement with a, with a number 10. is one player we want to keep uh, at least until the summer then his contract is only one year so it's uh, more likable that uh, we both agree that uh, eventually oh he signed a new contract oh he has uh, he will be sold uh, at the moment i have uh, four four offers for, for four four players in, in in the squad which obviously are all discussed with mr savidis end of the day he's the one who has to say yes or no so far that i hope that uh, it will be uh, no uh, no of the of the players we really want to to stay that they will uh, that they will stay with us and not uh, not leave the club in january i think i'm drowning asphyxiated i want to break the spell that you've created you're something beautiful a contradiction I'm we have our we have a, a few players obviously who's out of contract in the summer um uh, so we're talking about that and uh, uh, I have uh, proposed uh, my ideas to Mr. Samidis already before Christmas. Uh, there's no um, uh, clear clear answer at the moment for, for a player. Yes, he, he wants to sign. We have already done a few of them. Eh? Mr. Kiris uh, signed also this year. Pelgas was very happy. He had only six months left, so he signed three years. Uh, uh, Nidis we just did. Unfortunately, he's injured, but he will come back. He's young, he's strong. Um, so we have done some, some things which I think is good for power, especially the young kids who are not so young anymore because they're playing the first team. So this is important that they are staying longer for us.
I think it's very important that he's very much involved in the club. He's very, he has a love for the club and he wants to do the best for the club. So this is, this is, this is a good thing. And I have learned now to, to, uh, to, uh, to give him the information what he wants the way he wants it, because this is my job. To say, listen, there's a place you want to be very effective uh, and, and straight uh, forward, and then so he can say yes or no to, to, to things. So, and, and this is working better and better for my But it's also obviously experience for, for both of us. We have to learn so we know each other better. We have to be realistic that uh, Olympiacos has the best team. They've also had the best. Uh, um, they've also the best chances to get the best players in because they're playing Champions League. The players want to play uh, from outside at least. They want to play in Olympiacos because they know they will play uh, Champions League. And if you play Champions League, also you can go from 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 Greece to a bigger bigger clubs. You see that, and everybody looks. European League is is important but the most important Champions League. And if you go in there and you play some good games, then the clubs are coming after you. That is, that is just a fact. So that is why they, have, uh, they are more attractive for, 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 for players, plus they have more money because of that. And the only thing is that we have to challenge that. We have to do it in our way. We have to build this up. I hope we can, we can come closer and closer to them. And our aim is at least to uh, to be second, uh, let me say first in the, in, in, in the playoffs, so we can qualify for the pre rounds of uh, Champions League. Ο Άνεσεν, ναι. είναι νέο, έχει και μέλλον, έχει δείξει τι είναι και πρέπει να μείνει στον Πάοκ. Είναι πολύ νωρί. Για να κρυθεί. Σωστά. Το κρίνουμε σε τέλο τη χρονιά. Η ουσία είναι ότι χρειαζόταν κάποιο άνθρωπο και σε μια σωστή επιχείρηση πάντα υπάρχουν οι άνθρωποι που έχουν τι γνώσει. Πιστεύω ο Άρνε είναι μεγάλο όνομα για την Ελλάδα. Είναι πολύ τέλεια για τον Μπάουκ. Α του αφήσουμε να κάνουν τη δουλειά του και νομίζω ότι δεν θα χάσουμε. Ακόμα δεν έδειξε τίποτα. Περιμένουμε πολλά ακόμα. Είναι αρχή. Έχει κάνει όμω μια τουζίνα μεταγραφέ οι οποίε δεν προχώρησαν. Όλε σε κανένα δεν βγαίνουν όλε όμω. Περιμένω, περιμένω. Δεν έχω δει ακόμα, δεν με έχει πείσει. Απλά θέλω να δώσω κι άλλο χρόνο.